guys, it's Great Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting to episode 9 of Onimai. Yes, I'm using the Crunchyroll version, so yeah, I already know. I'm sorry, there's nothing I can really do about it. That's all I can say. Other than that, let's go to get started in 3, 2, 1, go. I, I was waiting for that. <laughs> Please tell me Baby is not going to spy on his sister the whole episode on a date. I can see that though. Yeah. Christmas tree is pretty. Oh my god, baby, you don't have to. <laughs> huh? We're gonna stalk my sister. She's going on a date. We need to know who. It's Kaeda, ain't it? Yeah, it's just Kaeda! Oh, and the outfit's cute. I figured. I mean, yeah, you know, you kind of secretly wanted to be a guy because they're like, oh, I should really be somebody. But it's just Kaeda. <laughs> I mean, heck, these two could secretly be dating. No, you're already out. Why don't you just stay? That's exactly what I said. Seriously, that outfit is just so good. Love the boots. My girly side.
I mean, yeah, but something kind of secretly tells me they're shopping for you two. Let's see, I feel like Mahito has like really, mmm, kinda baby has fashion sense in a way. I, I don't know if she'll pick something cute. Oh, I like it! Oh. Yeah, you do have some good taste. I mean, but hold up. What about me? She doesn't always want to look cute, though. You know, just out. <laughs> and of course, I mean, it's Kaede. I knew that was coming. Uh, but she's so cute. <laughs> so pretty. Goodbye, that's so fucking cute. And died. Oh my god, the fucking raising the bar. <laughs> so like it's all it's so cute. Aww. 
I mean, but it was a date, though. You like it? Aww. <laughs> I mean, because you two are close. Uh, of course. <laughs> <laughs> I'm yeah, I'm about to say. Ah, uh, yes. You don't gotta go to the shrine. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I'd be like, I am in hell. <laughs> Always gotta go out, duh.
<laughs> of course. Right? I thought you all would dress up together. <gasps> Kitty! <laughs> oh, hey, you too. <laughs> well, you know, just going with flow. Thought it looked cool. Uh, bingo! Like, I was not ready to hear that. Oh, my God. <laughs> Poor baby. So... Damn, that quick? I mean, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right? Yeah. <laughs> 
<laughs> no, no, me is gonna stay. <laughs> But like, yeah, what happened? Well, um... Yeah. <laughs> I mean, if it's just like that with just only a teeny tiny bit, uh, I cannot imagine if she had like a big ass glass hole. I mean, because, you know, we all know our limits. It happens. I like this. Yeah, yeah. Very sweet and adorable. <laughs> like, cute AF diabetes, cute ask. I mean, seriously, number one, um, the date between our four babies just that was sweet. I mean, yes, I love how <laughs> my hero is just like, hold on, we gotta know what Miyagi is doing. I said, we need to know. Who the F she going on a date with? Because, of course, yes, I mean, still, that is, you know, her big brother. Well, him as his, his big brother self inside of a girl being like, yes, I need to protect my younger sister. Hold up. Even though you a baby, you a girl, and you, you teeny tiny. You can't have, like, the big brother moment that you want. But yeah, once you found out it was Kaede, it was just like, okay, I'm cool with this. I mean, because I like, am. Yeah. It was still a date, though. Both of them went on a date. It was cute. I mean, yeah, in the end, they just got them, like, scarves to match. Because, yes, Momiji. <laughs> Momiji and him technically really are. And I kind of consider it, too, a couple. They're always together now, in a way. So, yeah, why not just get something for them together to, you know... Kind of make it official, you know? Yeah. And there's boobs and that. <laughs> what? You know, episode time. I, you know, no, 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 wait, wait, wait. I thought titles of certain animes, especially isekai animes, were the weirdest. And then you get titles of episodes and you're just like, what? What the fuck is that shit? <laughs> But it was really sweet. I mean, honestly, just to see <laughs> me <laughs> for like what one two minutes. <laughs> Poor I mean, she she did a lot in her little minutes of jump, but like it's just it, it does make me wonder like how much alcohol like you know how like when you're mm, I gotta think oh uh, my god. Um, the percentage rate of alcohol and stuff. Some I've seen some alcohols and tasted some alcohols that like the number level is fucking high. And yeah, of course, like with that maybe um not one little teeny tiny sip, but maybe like halfway through the whole bottle or the whole bottle itself, like yeah, you're you're gonna feel something. I mean, trust me, like if someone was had like one night when I was out <laughs> with a group of friends and my mom, or my mom's friends and my mom, um, I, I was given so many shots, like so many butter nipples, buttery nipples, like so many times that like, I, I was, I was gone. I could still, you know, concentrate and speak normally, but I was gone. And then when I was, when it was my birthday, 21st birthday, I was hella gone. Like, mm-mm. To the point that I, I, I knew 
I was gone, and then me and my girlfriend, it's like 3, 4 o'clock in the morning, and we are just <laughs> sitting there watching Bleach and, and just talking and talking and talking. <laughs> Be, being drunk will make you do some crazy <laughs> shit. <laughs> and then you wake up the next morning and be like, what the fuck happened last night? You're like, mm, yeah. <laughs> so always... <laughs> Moral of the story. Always have someone record your behind just in case you do something stupid. Thank God this never really happened to me. Yes. <laughs> Other than that, guys, that is my action towards episode 9 of Oni Mike. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every time I join the Master Squad. And of course, I will see you guys officially all next Thursday for episode 10. Bye, guys.